When I was 16, something happened that changed my life. It was the day I discovered the Unity game engine. I always wanted to make stories. Making a game is a highly complex process. You have to be able to do a lot of stuff, like 3D modeling, programming, making music, and writing story. But I did them all. I remember the first time I uh, was invited to uh, make a biography video in the Culture House when I finished my first game after one year of development. And it was uh, a fantastic experience. People were around me asking me about myself and about my game. But my parents didn't like the idea that I was creating games and making art. My mother always said I could not live my life making games and I should focus on studying because it would get me a real job. I never liked that idea. So what I did was I started freelancing with companies selling 3D art or doing some projects for clients and I began to be confident in my skills. At that time I've begun going to game development competitions like game jams. I was invited to many events to showcase my work and my progress in my projects. I always wanted my work to be scientifically accurate because I loved physics. I do lots of research about the projects that I do. I wanted to know how things behave and how it's interacting with the world. I understand the mathematical formulas and I translate them into code. For me, it doesn't matter how much time it will take because I always try to make it as best as I can. And now, after more than four years, all that I discovered is that video games are more than 3D models and lines of code. I found that video games can change the world. That video games can change the way we think. I discovered that video games are philosophy. My name is Omar Hidusi, and I am 20 years old, a 3D artist and an independent video game developer.